Hello, my Aptera friends. My name is Bruce Nelson. I'm an Aptera volunteer brand ambassador. I also uh, run the Reddit group, R Aptera Motors. I'm a small investor in Aptera, and I hold the pre-order of the 42nd Aptera that uh, the production Aptera that they plan to build. So uh, I'd like to talk to you a little bit about why that is and what my interest in that terra is. As you can see, I'm talking to you from snowy southern Iowa in Lamoni, and uh, it's March 10th. Uh, this may not be the weather that you see the normal Aptera uh, videos from, uh, and I'd like to talk a little bit about the uh, use case in climates like this. Uh, Aptera is a two-place vehicle. Uh, it's going to be very similar to and replacing my Gen 1 Honda Insight, which uh, my wife and I have had for some time and which easily meets our needs as a couple. Uh, one of the things I'm really excited about Aptera is that uh, it um, is going to have enough room in the back to uh, sleep both of us on camping trips. Uh, even in weather like this, uh, we can be comfortable. Uh, the Aptera is uh, not a general purpose vehicle. It's definitely a niche vehicle. But uh, having worked in the environmental field for many years, I'm also very excited about uh, having something that's even lower impact than what our uh, Insight has right now. The uh, big reason I'm excited about Aptera for snow has to do with the ABS and traction control. As you can see, uh, our roads are going to be a little bit of a challenge much of the year. The Aptera ABS traction control system can sense wheel slip and adjust the torque on each given wheel 32 times per wheel revolution. That ends up being about every two and a half inches of tread travel and coupled with the uh, studded snow tires which I'm probably going to put on the vehicle they should do quite well. Uh, if you would like to discuss more about the ways that Terra can be used in your area of the country, uh, first of all you can find out the most authoritative information about it at aptera.us. I also run and edit the Reddit subreddit called R Aptera Motors, and we try and include most articles that are published on Aptera at that location. So uh, in the discussion here underneath the uh, video, I'd encourage you to ask questions and discussion, and uh, we'll be uh, counting down the time till possibly later this year. I have my own Aptera and can have videos produced uh, that uh, tell what that experience is like. Thank you very much.